You're right, guys, it's Capcom Tom here, and welcome to episode number 42 of Looking for Legends. Today, we're not actually going to be looking for legends, although if we get one, I won't complain. We are looking for the January transfer players because there's a whole load of really cool transfers that EA put into packs last night, including Juan Mata, who's going for about 250k. So, fingers crossed that we could pull him or any other transfer players. I'll consider it a victory if we get one of the transfer players. Now, if you're looking to buy some Ultimate Team Coins, go check out futcoinking.com. Their link will be down in the description. A fast, cheap and reliable coin service. And if you use the code CAP5 at checkout, you will get a discount. Now, you may be thinking, why are you on web app, Tom? Well, the reason is because, as most of you know from my uh, new flat tour, my internet is not working, I've just moved house and it's not up and running yet. So I have a wireless dongle that I can use uh, my computer, but I can't use my console. So I will be using the uh, web app to open some packs. Our first pack gives us form, so that's going to be the best pull of this pack opening so far. But obviously we are hoping to improve on that throughout this pack opening. Here we go with pack number 8. What's inside this one? We get Schmelzer, the German international left back from Dortmund, which isn't too bad a pull. I guess he is non-rare. We also get this guy who's uh, from Burkina Faso, I believe, and he has 89 pace. It's absolutely crazy. I wonder if he's any good. May have to build a team around him at some point. Right, pack number eight. Are we going to get lucky with pack number eight? We find Gaitan. So that is now our best pull of the episode so far. From Benfica, obviously left mid. I believe it's the first time we've got him. Actually, I may be wrong. Let's have a look and see if he's a duplicate. Yes, he is a duplicate, as so many cards are now. We also got the Celtic home kit. But, you know, we're moving up. Hopefully, we can keep on going. Right, pack number nine, and we get Keysling. So, I'm guessing that probably is our best pack so far, especially since we've got Javi Garcia in there as well. So, Keysling, you are now the best pull of the episode. Right, this is the halfway mark. This is pack number 10. What's in pack number 10? We are going to get ourselves a Kabul 80 rated overall. We also got Wilfred Boney as well as Arba Lower. So, that's actually a pack full of decent players. Again, not the best in terms of rating, so we're going to stick with Keysling as our best pull, but a very nice pack nonetheless. Right, here we go. Unlucky pack number 13. Will it provide us with the goods? And yes, it does. We get Fernando Torres, best pull of the episode so far, as well as Cardozo. So that's a decent one. I was actually looking at Fernando Torres the other day in um, FIFA through the years. And it turns out that he had a very, very quick card on FIFA 10. But you can see there, it's now only 77. But still a decent pull. I'm happy with that one. Will the Alaba pack be good to me today? Come on, Alaba. Show me the money. And we get Quadrado. So an 81 rated player. We also get Zanetti, the right mid from Intel. He used to be a right back, I believe. Or a centre defensive mid. He used to be something else. Uh, I think he's had quite a different, lot of different cards. Maybe I'll look at him in uh, FIFA through the years at some point. Right, here we go with the second to last pack. Come Come on EA, this has been pretty appalling this pack opening to be honest. We get Bernard and Remy, so that is a decent pack, you know, I do like those two players. Not going to sell for all that much, you know, but uh, two more to add to the club. Right, here we go guys, final pack of this pack opening. I have to apologise about how bad it's been, we've barely pulled a thing in this pack opening, but we finish it off with a bang. There's David Luiz and Diego Melito in the same pack, that's going to be the best pull of the episode by a mile. I hope you've enjoyed it guys obviously if you could drop it a like for managing to pull it back right at the end um, that would be absolutely amazing subscribe if you're new to my channel but other than that I'm going to have to leave it there and I will see you all next time